The Singapore Foreign Affairs Minister Vivian Balakrishnan has paid tribute to Singaporeans working and living in Timor-Leste for their contributions to the fledgling nation. He has thanked them for flying the flag high and for maintaining the standing reputation of Singapore. Dr. Balakrishnan is on a four-day visit to Timor-Leste and witnessed the launch of a Singapore Community Association. Laura Nong has more from the capital city. Here on this dusty lane, located just outside of Delhi city centre, lies a place where some take up to an hour on foot just to get here. So why make such a treacherous journey? Well, it's one of the few community health centres in the whole municipality with a population of 165,000 people. On top of emergency and maternity services, it also treats specific conditions like tuberculosis and malnutrition. In fact, it's the busiest community health centre in the whole country, serving the most number of patients in any given point in time. Two Singaporeans have big roles to play in this. They run Maluk Timor. It's an NGO that trains local healthcare professionals. There is a gap in terms of that system being able to work well and deliver high quality care for people. And so we try and help that primary health care system to perform better. So we do a fair amount of training of health care providers, of doctors, nurses, midwives, allied health and, and all cadres of uh, health providers. Um, another thing that we do is infrastructure uh, improvement or development. Dr. Raja Raman and his wife, Dr. Lois Hong, have been in Timor Leste for the past three years, and they don't plan to leave anytime soon, not till their work is done. The couple, according to Dr. Vivian Balakrishnan, is one of many Singaporeans helping to support Timor Leste's development. He's calling on them to further support the country as it prepares to join ASEAN in the future. Dr. Balakrishnan says that in his conversations with the Timorese, it's not just the official and the diplomatic ties and contributions that they value. Actually, it's the people whom you see in front of me right now. There are pioneers who have been here for more than two decades. And you represent a wide variety of Singaporeans. Businessmen, entrepreneurs, missionaries, educators, doctors, volunteers. You represent the best of what Singapore can offer. To help Singaporeans stay in touch, a community association has also been launched along with a new clubhouse. We want to create a vibrant and supportive community for Singaporeans working or living in Timor-Leste. While at the same time, uh, we want to uh, foster close connections with the local community. I think it is important that Singaporeans come together, we harness their energies, and then we spur each other on uh, to greater heights, to success that we have all come to Timor to pursue. Mr Lim estimates that there are currently about 80 Singaporeans in Timor-Leste. He hopes that with the upcoming resident embassy and this new association, more would join them here. Lauren Ong, CNA, Dili.